Hi, I'm Michelle Hurd, a registered dietitian with the Perth District Health Unit, and today I'm going to explain how to roast squash. Squash is uh, a locally grown Ontario vegetable that keeps for a, a long time over the winter. Um, so this is an egg corn squash. There are many varieties you're probably familiar with, butternut squash. Um, I find that people kind of tend to stay away from the acorn squash because it has a thick skin and people often um, don't want to have to peel it. So roasting it is a great way to get around having to peel the squash. All you need to do is scrub it on the outside. We're going to cut it in half, remove the seeds, and then uh, roast it in the oven at about 400 degrees for maybe 30 minutes. I'm going to make a flat edge on both sides so that the squash does not slip away from me when I'm cutting through it. Okay, you can remove the seeds. I'm going to put them in the compost. But I've often um, used the seeds, uh, strain them like you would for pumpkin seeds and roast them in the oven. And we have a, a blog that demonstrates how to do that. So you simply scoop the seeds out and I'm just going to not even add oil, any kind of flavoring at all. I'll flavor it once it comes out of the oven and just place it cut side down in the baking dish. I've lined it with parchment paper, the baking dish, so it's easy cleanup. Another way to cook the squash when you roast it, instead of just keeping it um, cooking in at halves, you can cut it into wedges. And then um, you just, for serving, you just take the wedge and um, that would be your serving of squash. All right, so the uh, squash has cooked now, um, and the wedges and the half, um, the half section of the squash cooked at the same time. So I can tell that the squash is done because you can pierce it easily with a fork. When I'm just serving the squash wedges, I would just put the wedges on a plate. You can drizzle it with olive oil and a dash of salt and pepper. And for the squash wedge, you could scoop it out of the, uh, the skin and mash it up and season it any way you like.